Tables are perfect for organizing product details, store plans, or other content. With PageFly's table element, you can easily create and customize them. Firstly, take a look on how to access the table element. Here we are in the page editor, heading to the add element icon, and you can find the table element in the drop-down menu. The table element offers a variety of options to meet your specific needs. Select the desired option, then simply drag and drop it onto the page to begin using it. This serves as a practical example of utilizing a table element by adding table element to product details section to show more information. Moving into the general configuration of table element, here you can set style for the element. There are six styles for the table that you can choose from. I will choose hovered rows. You can adjust the number of columns and rows for the table here. There are two options for you to choose which rows or columns are the header here. I will choose the first row. To change the text in the table, click on the cell and type the text in text content parameter. Here's the table after I added all content. Next, we will delve into various styling configurations for the table element. The first parameter to consider is the content color. You have the freedom to choose any color you desire for the text within the table. The second parameter is spacing. You have the ability to adjust the padding and margin to personalize the spacing between the table and its container. Scroll down to typography. You can modify the font family, font size, and text alignment. Furthermore, you can add background color or background image for the table to make your table stand out, you can adjust the effect parameters. There are two options available, opacity and shadow. By enabling the shadow feature, you can fine tune the shadow of the table using functions such as shadow horizontal offset, shadow vertical offset, shadow blur, and shadow color. Don't forget to switch to mobile view to check the responsive. You can reduce the font size or any spacing to make it look more beautiful on mobile. Save and publish your work. And check it on live view. This is the end of the video tutorial. Don't forget to subscribe us on YouTube channel to get more new videos. Our friendly and knowledgeable team is available via live chat 24-7. Thanks for watching.